From being a well-known tourist destination, Thailand is also home to 143,000 expatriates who are skilled workers. They come from different nationalities and have relocated here to work, invest in business and real estate or study. And some have families here in Thailand. This is due to the good quality of life despite the low cost of living and friendliness of the Thai people. Since the start of the COVID-19 pandemic, these expats have made lifestyle changes following guidelines set by the Thai government's Ministry of Public Health. I'm from Taiwan. It's actually quite close. I feel the people, the food, the surroundings, the weather. It's just so easy to, to live here. I think we're quite fortunate that we're living in Thailand. We're still going to work as usual. We go out to meet friends as usual. Of course, we have to observe all these preventive measures to keep ourselves safe. But I feel like it is very safe, just having a normal life. So the, you know, keeping the social distance and always washing our hands and, you know, clean. These are very basic things that we do now every day. I fell in love with the country. Sukhumvit is the most populous area filled with expats of different nationalities. It's the chosen location to live as many multinational corporations are located here. Second comes the Ratada Rama 9 area, which is also known as the New Chinatown, followed by Tonburi Taksin. This is Korean town in Bangkok. It's the center of Korean food and goods, which is still vibrant and is frequently visited by local Koreans and Thais. And not far away from Korean town is Japanese town where you will find plenty of supermarkets and restaurants famous among the Japanese. え、the expatriate group do enjoy discovering more about culture and the local way of life of us Thais. They also enjoy getting in touch with nature. During these times where there are restrictions in travelling abroad, it is the perfect opportunity to encourage the expat group to get to know Thailand. In the past, the Ministry of Tourism and Sports arranged trips for expats, including representatives from the embassies and members of the press residing in Thailand. They were introduced to new tourist destinations, highlighting travelling responsibly like Bangkatao, Chiang Khan and Dam Nun Saduak floating market. Apart from this, the TAT joined hands with other tourism stakeholders in organizing events to promote sales. The expat travel deal event offered plenty of great deals for expatriates. Popular destinations for this group included the South, followed by the North and East. However, in another part of Bangkok, there are some other small expat communities, like right here. Families enjoy spending time at this farm. It's like being in the countryside, seeing the agricultural way of life, a fun place to be outside the home on a day off. And these are testimonials of how expats are confident in living a new normal life in Thailand right now and assure those who want to visit the country of what the situation is like. <laughs> 